Hey guys, this is Chase at Rocky Mountain 8 to VMC, and this is our Off-Road Helmet Buyer's Guide. All right guys, so we have over 25 brands of helmets here at Rocky Mountain. So we know that choosing a helmet can be very tough. So what we've done, we've narrowed it down. We've taken our rider expertise, our product knowledge, and we have broken it down into five of our top choices here at Rocky Mountain. Now we've used a combination of safety, fit, weight, and bang for your buck to bring you our five top helmets. Now we're gonna walk through and talk about these one by one. We're gonna talk about the standout features that each one has and why these made our top five. So whether you're just starting out, if you're buying for a friend or family member, or if you're looking to upgrade your helmet, this is gonna be a perfect starting point. So sit back, relax, and let's get right to it. All right, so first up on the list is gonna be the Bell Moto 9 Carbon Flex. Now, Bell's been around a very long time, and they continue to make some of the best off-road helmets that are available today. Now, with this helmet, you're getting a carbon fiber Kevlar weave shell, so it's very lightweight, it's very strong, and this helmet comes in at 3.3 pounds. We absolutely love the look and design of this helmet. It has a ton of air intake, so it's gonna breathe extremely well, and you are gonna get the 2015 Snell and DOT rating with this helmet. But the main reason that this helmet made our top five pick is if we look at the bottom here, Bell is using their all new three layer impact liner system. So your traditional helmets just have one liner. The Bell is using three liners. Each has a different density and each one is built to absorb impacts at different speeds. Your low, your medium, and your high speed. That is extremely important. And in the top of this helmet, they have what they call a slip zone. And that slip zone allows the helmet allows your head and the liner to actually move just enough inside the helmet to disperse energy at when you have those angular crashes. If you're moving forward or side to side, it's gonna disperse that extremely well. Now, the last thing we wanna point out with safety in this helmet is they use their magnetic emergency removal cheek pad system. Your typical cheek pads are gonna be snap-ins. These are actually magnetized, so they're extremely easy to pull out and they just go right back in. That is very important for an EMT or a first responder. It's gonna allow them to take those cheek pads out to get your helmet off very easily. And the last thing we wanna point out, doesn't speak volumes and safety, but it's awesome for functionality. Their chin strap here, rather than being a snap, it's actually magnetized as well. Just goes right there, it's extremely easy to use. That's a nice feature from Bell Helmets. Now the sizing on this bad boy, this is a size medium. We checked their sizing chart. We had a few guys here try on this helmet. We feel that it is gonna fit true to size, so make sure you check out their sizing chart on our website. However, we did feel that the cheek pads do fit a bit snug, but up around the crown of your head where, it's the, where it matters the most, it's gonna fit true to size. This is the Moto 9 Carbon Flex from Bell Helmets. All right, so next up on the list is the F2 Carbon from Fly. Now, from a design standpoint, this is one of our favorite helmets. We love the aggressive look to it. If I turn it sideways here, you can see that shell. Fly has a lot of cool graphics that go along with this helmet, so make sure you check out the full collection on our website. Now this helmet, it comes in at three pounds. It's very lightweight, it's very popular for that reason, and the way they get it that lightweight is they use an aircraft grade carbon fiber Kevlar mix in that shell. You're gonna get a dual density liner on the inside. That's gonna give progressive impact absorption for a broader range of impacts while you're out riding. And it's gonna have 11 intake vents on the front, so this thing is gonna breathe and keep your head extremely cool. Now sizing on this guy, this is a size medium. We know that it fits true to size because we've had a lot of guys try it on. However, in the cheek pad area, we do feel that it fits a little snug, but up here around the crown where it matters, it's gonna fit true to size. Now the biggest reason we chose this helmet to be in our top five is this is a pro level helmet. This is a helmet that Trey Kennard, Andrew Short, and Weston Pike are all wearing, and it retails for less than 300 bucks. So for that price point, which is less than half of some of the other helmets that we have up here, that is extremely hard to beat. So that is the F2 Carbon from Fly. All right, so next up is gonna be the MX Jump from Suomi. Sometimes it's called the Mr. Jump. It's the same helmet. Now this helmet has a lot of key things that we wanna talk about. First of all, it's gonna have a carbon fiber Kevlar weave shell. It's gonna be lightweight. This thing has a reputation for being one of the best ventilating helmets on the market, but the biggest reason, the standout feature in this helmet is its weight. This bad boy comes in at 2.6 pounds. It is one of the, if not the lightest helmet on the market that is ECE and DOT rated. So if you're a guy that does long rides, if you're a desert racer, this is gonna be a great choice for you. If we look at the inside, we love their Cool Max inner liner. 
It's cool to the skin and it wicks away moisture extremely well. We like the design and look at this helmet. Suomi has a lot of cool colorways, so make sure you check those out on our website. Sizing on this guy, this is a size medium. We've tried it on. We know that it fits true to size, so use your sizing guide on our website and order the size that it calls for. This is the MX Jump from Suomi. All right, so fourth up on our list is gonna be the V1 from Fox. So Fox has four helmets in their lineup, and there's a few distinct reasons why we put the V1 in our top five. So starting with the outside, you're gonna have a polycarbonate shell. Now this helmet comes in at 3.2 pounds, so it's very lightweight for having that polycarbonate shell. If we look at the front, you're gonna have nine intake vents on the front, so this helmet's gonna breathe very well. We love the look and design of this helmet. Fox has a ton of colorways that we love, so you can see all those colorways on our website. The sizing on this helmet is true to size according to Fox's sizing guide, so go to our website and look at their sizing chart, and that'll tell you what size you're gonna need. Now, the biggest reason that this is an awesome choice for a helmet, and the reason it makes our top five, is you're getting a DOT rated helmet. It's lightweight at 3.2 pounds, and you get awesome design and graphics, and that's all gonna be for less than $200. So bang for your buck if you're on a budget, this is gonna be an awesome choice. So check out the V1 from Fox. All right guys, so last but certainly not least is gonna be the ATR1 from 6D. Now 6D is the newest helmet maker that we have up here today, but they are bringing new technology and innovation into this helmet that we are really excited about. So looking at it, you're gonna have a tri-composite shell. This bad boy comes in at three and a half pounds, and it, we know it's gonna ventilate very well. If you look at the front, it has a lot of intake vents along the eyebrow and along the chin bar, so it's gonna breathe and push air through extremely well. Now you are gonna get the latest DOT rating with this helmet. If we turn it sideways, we like the design and look of the helmet. 60 has a lot of cool colorways, so make sure you check those out on our website. So sizing with this helmet, just like the rest of these helmets that we have up here, we've tried them all on, we've had multiple people wear them. We know that according to 6 d sizing chart, this is gonna fit true to size, so check that out on our website, and that'll tell you what size you're gonna need to get. Now with this helmet, the key feature that really separates it from all the other helmets and makes it stand out is it's gonna be its omnidirectional suspension technology. So in this helmet, you have a dual liner system, and those two liners are separated by 27 isolation dampers. And those are built to absorb energy at your low, mid, and your high speed impacts. And for those angular crashes, when you're moving forward or side to side, it's gonna help absorb and disperse that energy extremely well. So that's patented technology from 6D. This is the only helmet with it, and it is absolutely awesome. If you look at the liner, you're gonna have a very good moisture wicking liner on the inside of this helmet, it's very comfortable. And the last thing we wanna point out with this helmet is 60 actually makes a youth version in this helmet. So for all you moms and dads out there, it's called the ATR1Y. And what it is, it's the same helmet with the same technology, but it's a softer shell and a softer liner, and it is made to absorb impact for those developing brains. So make sure you check those out. So this is the ATR1 from 6D. A lot of safety, a lot of technology built in, and that is why it's made our top five. So to help you out with your choice, we put together this chart that has the stats of each one of these helmets on the table so you can see exactly how they match up to each other. So thanks for checking out our off-road helmet buyer's guide. We hope we've narrowed it down just enough to make the process of choosing your next helmet a little bit easier. But remember, go to our website at RockyMountainATVMC.com where you can see the full collection of these helmets, all the colorways, as well as shop all the other brands of helmets that we carry on our website. We have our fit guarantee, so no matter what helmet you buy, you are gonna be able to send it back if you're not happy with the fit, and we will make sure you get the right size on that first exchange free of charge. Anything over $99 is always gonna ship free. So do yourself a favor, click and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't already. Leave us your thoughts and comments. We wanna know what helmets you think should be in these top five. We wanna know what helmet you're wearing and what you like about it. I'm Chase with Rocky Mountain, and we'll see you on the trails.